<coughs> well, the Honourable Member for Bendigo. Thank you, Deputy Speaker. In my opinion, nobody sums up how horrible these higher education reforms are for Australian universities and their students than the words of Jamal Barbaker, who is a shopping centre cleaner and a proud United Voice member. He arrived in Australia 16 years ago as a refugee, and he says that it's not his work as a cleaner that makes him a happy man, but the fact that his three children have been able to complete a higher education. Yeah, yeah. It is an opportunity that he says that this government's higher education reforms will deny future students from low-income families like his own. Jamal himself holds a law degree from Sudan. It is worthless here. But Jamal states that he had his chance at life, and he and his wife believe that their greatest joy, their greatest challenge, has been to give their children an opportunity to go to university in this great country. He fears that the deregulation of tertiary education will lock out young people like his children from their chance at an education. He wants every kid to have the chance like his kids had, and he says that this is something that we must fight for. Regardless of your postcode or the size of your parents' wallet, every child like Jamal's children should have the opportunity to a university education, and I, like Labor, will stand and fight with Jamal Order. against these changes. Order. The